Shazbot says, is conspiracy theory like a scientific method which is limited to the hypothesis stage? No, 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 no. And, and this is where we're not preparians. Scientific method is not about coming up with random hypotheses. Huh, I wonder what causes that. Okay, let me think about this. It's not how science works. You don't start with random thoughts. You don't start with something popping into your head. You don't start with just a hypothesis out of nowhere. The scientific method starts with facts, with observations about reality. Facts about what you're, what you're observing or what you're discovering or what you're going to hypothesize about, about the phenomena you're studying. And then from those facts, you see some connections. You see some similarities and differences, and you see some relationships. And from that, you, in a sense, induce a hypothesis, which you then test. But the hypothesis is not random. It's not detached from reality. It's the opposite. The scientific method requires that the true scientific method, not the one that they claim to practice today, starts with reality, and then it ends with reality, because the confirmation has to be in reality. So things like, and here I'm a bit out of my league, so maybe I'm wrong on this, so you'll have to, a physicist can correct me if I'm wrong, but people just have, coming up with a string theory, with no connection to reality, not based on any facts, not, no observations. It's not real science. So all science begins with reality. It doesn't begin in the head of the scientist. This is part of the, the um, um, damage, I think, is my understanding, a popper is. And I think uh, from my reading of um, Deutsch, this is what they think. They think it starts in the head of the scientist, and there's certainly element of primacy of consciousness there. Thank you for listening or watching The Iran Brooks Show. If you'd like to support the show, we make it as easy as possible for you to trade with me. You get value from listening. You get value from watching. Show your appreciation. You can do that by going to iranbookshow.com slash support, by going to Patreon, Subscribestar, Locals, and just making a appropriate contribution uh, on any one, of those, uh, any one of those channels. Also, if you'd like to see The Iran Book Show grow, please consider sharing our content and, of course, subscribe Press that little bell button right down there on YouTube so that you get an announcement when we go live. And for you, those of you who are ready subscribers and those of you who are ready supporters of the show, thank you. I very much appreciate it.